friends welcome to quick learn in quick learn i have started a new series on plc and scada so uh, this is lecture number 3 of plc and scada series here i discuss so in this video i will explain you what is scada what is scada system and how scada work with the help of example so let's start with the topic first we know about what do you mean by scada scada stands for supervisory control and data acquisition system what do you mean by supervisory control what do you mean by data acquisition system so supervisory control means it enable the operator to remotely control the device supervisory control means it enable the operator to remotely control the device for example if we want to open or close any valve in plant or if we want to operate any motor remotely so we use scada system and what do you mean by data acquisition data acquisition means collection of data from where we collect data the elements the component which is connected in the processing plant or manufacturing plant we collect data from that element and we perform supervisory control process remotely so hope you understand the meaning of scada system scada system basically remotely control all the process of production plant or manufacturing plant via collection of data with the element which is connected in the plants so it is basically a software it means scada is basically a software whereas plc is basically a hardware or it is a computer graphic that is installed in our computer or pc to control any process so we can say that with the help of scada system we remotely access or control any manufacturing plant or any production plant scada is an industrial computer based control system employed to gather and analyze the real time data to keep track monitor and control industrial equipments in different type of industries uh, scada system provide centralized monitoring and controlling system so we can say that scada is a software through scada we provide supervisory control and data acquisition so we can say that scada is basically a centralized monitoring and control system now scada system collect data or acquire data from the primary elements or primary system in order to control that primary system or primary elements in the process plant Uh, this is done through the use of various hardware devices such as plcs programmable logic control that are installed in various location or or through the use of specialized software now in short we can say that scada is an industrial software installed in our pc it is very user friendly front end to control system that is easy communicate with plc so uh, by using scada software and plc we control a large production plant or large manufacturing plant so scada software are very useful to monitor and analyze historical as well as new data it allow remote monitoring this is important scada system allow remote monitoring and controlling of various plant operation in real time basis suppose if we are sitting on a room and uh, if we want to control uh, any manufacturing plant or any production plant so with the help of this scada software we gather information we gather data from the element and we remotely monitor and control the elements of that plant and we control the overall operation of that plant in real time basis scada system are generally used in automation industry alone with plc so for doing remote monitoring and controlling we also use scada and plcs 
now application of scada system uh, there are large number of applications now a day of scada system uh, as i have already told scada is basically used in large manufacturing or processing plant so uh, for example electric power generation plant we use scada system for automation for automatic transmission and distribution of power uh, for oil and gas refineries we use scada system for uh, water treatment plant or waste water treatment plant we use scada system for uh, environment cleaning for other uh, different type of traffic signal we use scada system so there are vast application of scada system nowadays in my coming videos i will discuss more about scada system so this is the scada system as i have already told scada is basically a software that install in a pc and with the help of this scada software we control the whole processing plant or whole processing equipments of the plants so uh, with the help of plcs and hmi hmi is human machine interface which is connected to different plcs plc I, as i have already told this is a hardware microprocessor based hardware device so number of plc is connected here now number of equipments of the plant just like motor machine pump uh, all are connected with the help of plc so there are number of plc connected with human machine interface and equipment of the manufacturing plant just like motor pump valve etc all are connected with plcs so these equipment give real time data to the plc plc transmit the, this real time data to the scada software with the help of hmi then scada collect that data acquire that data it means uh, start data acquisition process and maintain a database with the help of this data which is collect in the database scada control the overall processing of the plant so this is called the scada system which contain plcs hmis and scada software now i will give a brief or quick description how scada software install or how is with the help of scada system we control any process plant suppose if we want to control oil and gas refinery plant so uh, in scada software this is the graphical representation or this is the layout of the overall plant if we want to start this plant we use this push button start plant these two are the pump pump number 1 pump number 2 so if we want to start this pump this is called river pump if we want to start river pump we use start button if we want to stop this pump we use stop button we also open or close this valves we we also find out the river flow because scada system gather real time information and now this is the lubrication tank and these are the wet wells um here we see this green line indicate 74% full it means this wet well is 74% full now with the help of this valve and these are the three pump pump 1 pump 2 and pump 3 we start or stop this pump with the help of this button start button or stop button and these are the pressure tank uh, so we also control pressure uh, with the help of this pump and we analyze the original or real time data so in this way we control overall plant if we want to shut down the plant we use this shut down button so in this way scada software install and control the control any manufacturing plant in my coming videos later i will explain more examples in detail so uh, hope you like the video for more interesting video please keep watching and keep sharing my video with your friends